What's good, YouTubers and YouTubettes? This is JB Sports back again with another one. Floyd Money Mayweather has offered to pay for George Floyd funeral services. A great, great offer, a great gesture by the former pound for pound king. Uh, he runs uh, his record label TMT, and the president of his record label, Angel Jennings, grew up with George Floyd. And after having discussions with her, Floyd Mayweather Jr. has offered to pay for all his services. Now, his services are slated to take place in four different locations, Houston, Minnesota, Charlotte, and a fourth city yet to be named. So that's a good gesture. Not even a good gesture. That's a great gesture by Floyd Mayweather Jr. Now, Floyd Mayweather Jr. has made a lot of controversial statements in regards to Black Lives Matter. Just uh, about a year ago, he said... Uh, I'm not black. He didn't. He didn't agree with the Black Lives Matter movement. He said all lives matter, you know. And he, he got a lot of backlash from the black community, and it was uh, well deserved. But you got to give credit where credit's due. Right now, man, the money man who runs the money team, Floyd Mayweather Jr., has offered to pay for George Floyd uh, services, and it's uh, we'll be waiting to hear back from him, uh, George Floyd's family, if they take him up on that offer. But a great gesture by Floyd Mayweather Jr. You know, I did a video the other day about Michael Jordan, another guy who made some controversial uh, statements in regards to uh, the black uh, community and the black standing here in the United States. Uh, again, uh, he had a chance uh, through the urging of his uh, mother to back a, a black politician that was running against Jesse Helms, a prominent, uh, well-known racist in the political history. And uh, he declined to do that. And he made a statement about Republicans buy his sneakers, too. And he got a lot of backlash from the black community. But he said he said it in jest. And it was taken out of uh, context. But uh, what the end result was, he, he received a lot of backlash from that, from that statement. And uh, Floyd made have received a lot of backlash from, uh, you know, All Lives Matter. Now, we'll see once he uh, takes, you know, once the George Floyd family... Uh, you know, they make a statement on his uh, offer. Will they accept this offer or whatever the case may be? Or will they uh, look to uh, go another uh, route as far as uh, taking care of uh, their loved one, George Floyd, funeral services? That'll, re that'll remain to be seen. But uh, that's a great gesture by uh, Floyd Mayweather Jr. So I just want to do a quick uh, video, give a shout out. And uh, I like what uh, Floyd Mayweather Jr. did, man. Like I said, you know. You know, everybody can uh, see that uh, he's, uh, he's he's genuine in his statement. He wants to uh, help out. He didn't have to do that. He could sit on the sideline like a lot of these uh, big-name celebrities who have failed to this day to come out and speak against George Floyd's murder. They're, you know, they're, they're you know, in, the in the background quiet. I called them out in, in the last video. Some other names that I failed to mention. Tyler Perry, where you at? You know what I'm saying? Tyler Perry, where you at? Will Smith, where you at? Martin Lawrence, where you at? You know what I'm saying? Where you at? Where you at? A lot of these uh, prominent, you know, Rick Ross, where you at? Lil Wayne, where you at? A lot of these uh, top name celebrities need to uh, come out and voice their uh, displeasure with the George Floyd murder and speak out against this, man, because we, we're seeking ultimate justice for George Floyd and not just only him, but Breonna Taylor. Uh, Armand Aubrey, even Trayvon Martin, who uh, had an unjust uh, verdict in his uh, in his murder when George Zimmerman got off on that uh, case, which uh, was you know was which still upsets me to this day that that guy got away with murder, killing an uh, unarmed young innocent black teen. You know, it's a lot of other things. Sandra Bland, you know, Eric Garner. You know, I'm going to probably do a video a little later on about the uh, autopsy a report that came back uh, through Benjamin Crump's uh, independent uh, autopsy, which contradicts the autopsy report that came back from the medical examiner at the Minnesota uh, Police Department. You know what I'm saying? They're coming from the same playbook that they did with uh, Eric Gardner and that medical examiner. That, when, they, when that medical examiner in that case tried to insinuate that uh, Eric Gardner was unhealthy, you know, obese, overweight, and that led to his death, not the... Uh, Police department uh, officer uh, jumping on his back, put him in a chokehold, choking him out and choking all the life out of him. He, you know, he tried to say that it was uh, his uh, underlying health issue, and he tried to insinuate his uh, weight and obesity uh, contributed to his death. 
was the main culprit in his death, which was nothing but a bunch of BS. So leave your, uh, leave your uh, comments in the comment section, man. I got to get up out of here. I'm out here trying to make it happen, trying to work. But uh, leave your comments in the comment section. What you think about Floyd Money Mayweather Jr. Uh, offering his uh, services to help pay for the uh, funeral of George Floyd in all four cities that are scheduled to... Uh, have George, funeral, George Floyd funeral services in the coming days and coming weeks. Let me know what you think in the comment section. This is JB Sports, the man, the myth, the legend. Ah, uh -huh.